dictionary. This is one rule I must remember. I before E, except after C. Or when sounded like A, as in neighbor and way. Words ending in I, E, drop the E and change the I to Y before adding I, N, G. I before E, except after C. Let's see. I before E, except after H. No, I after E, after C. I before E, after, no, E before I, after C. When a word has the C before an ending, like frolic, or colic, or comic, and mimic, and picky, you always add a K before a pending. Huh? You know, sticking at E or I or Y. Oh, sure. For example, colicky, frolicker, picnicker, mimicker, and hickory dickory dockery. On the other hand, if softness is maintained, page 43, then E must be retained after C. You mean before the ending able, right? That keeps the spelling stable. So that's why. Of course, let's try. Noticeable, serviceable, embraceable, replaceable, peaceable, enforceable, pronounceable, intraceable. Slay, Stein, Fahrenheit. Accepting, fiery, hierarchy, hieroglyphic. E-I is also used in special words that merit careful study. E before I after C. Siege, however, is spelled I E. Otherwise, use I E in thief, belief, theme, niece, feel, brief, grief, cashier, achieve, yield. Only one word in the language ends in S E D E. Supersede. Three others end in C E E D. Exceed, proceed, succeed. All others end in C E D E. Exceed, concede, intercede, precede, recede, succeed. E before I after C. When a word ends in C, like frolicking, picnic, and mimic, insert a K before adding a suffix. Beginning with F, I, or Y, E, I is used immediately after the letter C. The single exception is fit in seer. E, I is used in words in which it has the sound of A, or the sound of I as in height. Slay, Stein, Fahrenheit. E, I is also used in special words. Leisure, seizure, see, she, protein.